Clematis terniflora, sweet autumn clematis. This is a climbing and creeping vine which can reach 50 to 30 feet high, although it depends on what the vine is climbing on. Foliage is deciduous and the leaves are oppositely arranged. The leaf shape is pinnately compound with three to five leaflets. Leaves are one to four inches long and leaflets are acute and subcordate or rounded at the base. These will sometimes appear lobed. Ornamental features include a straw-colored stem that on the exterior has 12 to 18 ridges. These ridges are the, actually the vascular bundles. The pith is white in color. These produce flowers that are one and a quarter inch across, fragrant, and have four sepals. These flower in August, early September, and will continue into October. The white flowers are fragrant and formed on terminal panicles and often look as if fresh snow is covering the entire plant. Cultural information for Clematis terniflora. These are hardy in zones 5 to 8, do best in full sun to part shade. They'll have insect problems with leaf spot and stem rot, as well as black blister beetle, Clematis borer, mites, white flies, scales, and other issues. These are native to Japan. Notes about Clematis terniflora. These can be a very vigorous vine that often engulfs whatever structure or plant these grow on. These can be extremely vigorous to the point of being vicious, and can become weedy if unkempt. To control Clematis terniflora, prune it back in late winter or early spring. This will allow it to flower in the following growing season. 